To be clear, I blame Larry Nasser, and I also blame an entire system that enabled and perpetrated his abuse. My name is Simone Biles, and I am a gymnast who is trained at the levels of the sport. I am also a survivor of sexual abuse. Why would duly sworn federal law enforcement officers ignore reports of abuse by a doctor across state lines and country borders? For a future job opportunity? Or were there additional incentives and pressures? Why must we speculate when the facts are obtainable and the stakes are so high? The records establish that Steve Penny, FBI agent Jay Abbott, and their subordinates worked to conceal Nasser's crimes. After reading the Office of Inspector General's OIG report, I was shocked and deeply disappointed at this narrative they chose to fabricate. They chose to lie about what I said and protect a serial child molester rather than protect not only me, but countless others. After I reported my abuse to USA Gymnastics, my family and I were told by their former president, Steve Penny, to keep quiet and not say anything that could hurt the FBI investigation. We now know there was no real FBI investigation occurring. While my complaints uh, with the FBI, Larry Nassar continued to abuse women and girls. During this time, the FBI issued no search warrants and made no arrests. As the Inspector General's report details during this time period, FBI agents did not properly document evidence, failed to report to proper authorities, and the special agent in charge was seeking to become the new Director of Security for the United States Olympic and Paralympic Committee, a job opportunity raised by Steve Penny. I sit before you today to raise my voice so that no little girl must endure what I, the athletes at this table, and the countless others who needlessly suffered under Nasser's guise of medical treatment, which we continue to endure today. Uh, I want to be crystal clear. The actions and inaction of the FBI employees detailed in this report are totally unacceptable. These individuals betrayed the core duty that they have of, uh, of protecting people. They failed to protect young women and girls from abuse. We suffered and continue to suffer because no one at FBI, USAG, or the USOPC did what was necessary to protect us. We have been failed and we deserve answers. Nasser is where he belongs, but those who enabled him deserve to be held accountable. <laughs>